flawless skin. I'm going to turn you print for Hi everyone. Welcome back to another Face Mask Friday. And Corey's not here today. Toby definitely is. We are going to try a pure and simple egg mask in which it's just going to be egg whites. And we'll see how it goes. How, how much are these eggs? I should have looked this up. It doesn't matter. You can get these at your local grocery store or farmer's market or chicken. I'm just going to crack it into here. And I'll teach you guys the proper techniques of how to crack an egg. Top tip, don't crack it on the bowl. Crack it on some flat. So here we go. Okay. So we'll actually start by just doing that. Ba boom And then, yeah, you just kind of shift it between the two shells. So that the big egg white just like goops out. And then, yeah, you just have your little egg white. It's kind of hard to see. We're going to use our lovely little Glam Glow face brush and put this lovely egg white all over our face. Oh boy, this is gonna be great. Ah, oh god, it's cold. <laughs> oh, and by the way, I, I also recommend don't eat this. Because you probably don't want to eat raw eggs. There's some debate about how dangerous it is, but f it, just don't. Oh, oh god, it's cold. <sighs> Why did we not? Ah! ah it, is a, it is a cooling face mask. There you go. There's no smell at all, um, at least I don't find that there's any smell to eggs, uh, like raw eggs, so yeah, nothing there. It feels, at the moment, just like a nice little lotion, actually. It's going on very, like, smoothly and evenly. Could be the fabulous Glam Glow face brush, um, trademark. What are the benefits? I have no idea. I was told to do this like 10 minutes ago. The quantity is very good. I still have like the entire bowl. There's a lot on my face going into my mouth, but none of it's, it's just like a fraction of what I have left. Good value for the like 25 cents from your local lizard. It's great. Favorite style cooked egg. I want to say I do have a favorite style, but it's like a whole recipe. It's just a really simple recipe that I do. So it's essentially just scrambled eggs. Um, but yeah, I like to then put it in like a burrito with some like salsa, some cheese, um, onions. Like uh, you can pretty much add anything you want. It's kind of great and really, really quick. And then you just wrap it all up, kind of sear the burrito just to kind of seal it. And, and you yeah, it. It's really... Uh, it's a really quick and simple egg, or er. perfect. Yeah, meal. It's tightening up, by the way. Um, yeah, like I can feel it, especially in my cheeks. I have no idea how long this mask is gonna take. It'll probably be like, I'm gonna guess 10 to 15 minutes. Would you guys ever put eggs on your face? Comment down below. How's your Good Fridays going, guys? Comment down below. How's my skin today? I love those comments. So keep them coming. My skin is flawless. <sighs> oh yeah, we're having a live stream soon. Um, I don't know. What do you guys think we should do on the upcoming live stream? Patreon apparently thinks that uh, we should do a decluttering video. So let's do that. Or? Or doing my makeup. Ah. It is really itchy. I'm not allergic to egg. Ah. I guess we'll do a live stream on the 20th. Which will be fun. So join us. We'll figure out what we're doing at the day of. It's my birthday, the 21st. So yeah, happy birthday to me. I think I'm gonna say it's pretty much done. For the most part, everywhere I am dry. Um, you can't really see a lot of it though. It actually does tighten up a fair bit been about five or ten minutes or so my hair is looking good but yeah I guess we'll take off the mask now wash it off I have a little bowl of water here and let's see if I can do this 
Uh, oh my god, I got it. There's a little bowl of water right here. These episodes where I'm alone are the worst because I just ramble. I wouldn't say it's coming off too easy. You kind of gotta like scrub a bit, but it is really easy to just wash off. Feeling the feeling of it. I feel like this might be enough. Um, I'm not sure. After this, I'm probably gonna you know, just go splash water because I don't know. Sometimes these don't work. It does actually tighten up a fair bit, so that's interesting. Are my wrinkles gone? Yeah, I guess they're gone. Um, it feels like I definitely need to moisturize right now. Um, but other than that, yeah, for a tightening mask, it's not bad. It doesn't moisturize at all. Um, it is very dry, but for that it's kind of cleansing, I guess. Um, so for whatever that's worth. Out of five, would I ever do this again? Yeah, it actually wasn't too bad and eggs are always on hand. So if I'm looking for like a easy, like dirt cheap mask that you just put it on and relax, it's not bad actually. Like it's actually, I'm, gonna, I'm trying to find a number value, like kind of between two and three. So yeah, it's actually like a, a mask, it's, it's, it's a thing. I would say try this one out just because if you're looking for like a cleansing mask, other masks are probably gonna give you a better experience anyway because of the fact that they have more to them. They're designed to be face mask rather than just an egg. Thank you everyone for watching. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, follow us on social media. Uh, and of course we have a Patreon if you want to subscribe to subscribe to the Patreon, participate. I don't know what to donate to it. There we go. Um, and yeah, Corey will be back again next week on Monday, which as a quick aside, apparently it's going to be another egg based mask for Easter. So that's the thing. She's gonna be showing you how to remove hair with an egg. That will be fun. So tune in for that on Monday. And of course, yeah, we'll see you again next week for another Face Mask Friday. Bye guys.